Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. This is Peter Drury, and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Hi, Peter. Always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. Tony Kroos. Hervides. Muller. Cruz. Mats Hummels, very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. And it's Ozil. Muller. Hervides. It's a good looking cross. Meets it first time. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. it upfield Traxler Mesut Ozil chance to shoot Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with and to find it I think it was a fine drive and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance That's a poor kick by the keeper, he's just given it straight back. Sergio Ramos plays it out to the wing. Well read, he sorted that out. Keeper's got good distance on that. Sergio Ramos does well there, alert. Modric. And it's Bale. Daniel Carvajal. Bale. Shoots! And the referee brings the first half to a close. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leading 1-0 at the break. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Tony Kroos. Bale, Daniel Carvajal, where to from here? Tony Kroos, that 
was good pressing, forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Gets into a dangerous position. And it's Bale. Daniel Carvajal. Out to the left it goes. Done very well to intervene. Well, they would seem to be trying to expose the centre of that defence to, to runners. It makes for some terrific movement. It does, and they may be hit on the break because obviously it requires numbers forward to, to stretch them out. He's tried one, top save, that shot was travelling. Away from immediate danger. It's a promising run he's making on the right. And the counter is on. Oh, that's a real stopper. He's put an end to the threat. Morata. Uh, the ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Pumps it forwards. It's a forceful run down the right, but he's short of options now. Cristiano Ronaldo is being picked on here. Well, they seem intent on marking him out of the game. They're certainly trying to wind them up in the process, Peter. Tries to stroke it through. Rafael Varane. Tony Kroos, and it's Modric, now it's Bale, Bale's cross, up to meet it, and he's straight offside. Yeah, the ball in set up the opportunity for someone to go and meet it, defenders were on their heels, he was on his toes, but you have to say that it was made even easier because of the marking, it just wasn't tight enough, well you have to feel a little for the player being taken off here, I think he's been made the scapegoat after that, but I guess something had to be done, I suppose it did need a little change. Nacho. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. It's a loose ball. Looking to shoot! Chance! Two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe. Great reactions in front of goal. He just saw what was on. Well, for me, that's just pure predatory brilliance. It's not so much the finish, but the way he read the situation when nobody else was even alert to it. It's fantastic.